Uh, uh, oi, welcome back to the Outer Worlds Spaces Choice Edition and the Heights Edition Permadeath Run with the squad Parvati and Nyoka. She got a new hair, star. That's Nyoka's hair, star. We're in Amber Heights. We're gonna talk a little bit here and there with people, not too much. I hate those people, especially you, Rose. I hate you, Rose, just for your name and just for your supply shield. Oh, well, I get myself mentally ready for motif pain and another wisdom doof removal. What are you buying? Wisdom tooth removal operation. Oh, which I'm gonna hate. I have asked you that already. We gotta eat. So okay, cool. Sure. Now I've sold my soul already in this game to a snap class. It's gonna carry me far. That was worthless. There was nothing behind here. Oh, no clue what they're talking about. A trash cube. Yeah, look at him. He just keeps making him. You're fucking weird, Carl. I don't think he can hear you. He's in the zone. The trash cube zone. You gotta admit, they're convenient. Fit together real nice. Trash is trash. I don't care what shape it's in. I guess. Oh, yeah, sure. Sure. Trash is trash. You, Tucker, need ham. <laughs> uh, he needs to go home also. Oh, I just fixed something for them. And again. I'm such a good dude. Your diary. Eat it, Hux. Uh, didn't I kill Hux already? Sure, you're welcome, guys. You're welcome. Okay, you, Tucker. Looks like I'm not the only new face around here. What do I call you, stranger? Daddy. Oh, it's Captain Ghoulpool. Welcome to Amber Heights, Captain. Call me Tucker. You here to join the Iconoclasts? Help us free this world? No, I'm here to send you back to your mama. Free? From what? Well, from the yoke of corporate tyranny. It's what all us Iconoclasts strive for. With Graham at the helm. We want unfettered freedom, not the lies that MSI tries to sell in Stellar Bay. True escape from all rules and constraints. You want to know more? Listen to Graham's broadcasts. He's no. been talking up a storm, working to elevate the minds of all the corporate drones in this colony, getting them to rise up. No. Oh. I like chaos and anarchy. No rules limit. Sounds like a utopia. It is. Just look at what a paradise Amber Heights is. We could take this world. No. Galaxy wide. You did it, Tucker. Talk to Graham. I think you two would get along swell. No. Ah, oh, Tucker, you Agnes little boy from Stella Bay, huh? I am not a little boy. Haven't been one for decades. No matter what my mama wishes. I take it she's still looking for me? Had hoped she'd accept my decision. Hmm. She made it seem like you were in danger. Asked me to rescue you. She offered a reward. And now that's better. She offered a reward to anyone who brings you back to Stella Bay. Let me guess. You're here to collect it. Well, I can tell you right now, it is not gonna happen. I won't go back. My entire life, she locked me in Stellar Bay because she was afraid. Don't go play with friends. Bantasaurs will tear your arms off. Don't leave the city. 
Raptodons will spit acid on your face. Marauders can violate you. You'd fall in a sulfur pool. Yeah. I stuck around way too long, ruled by her fears. I'm 42 years old, but she still sees me as a little boy in need of her protection. I won't stand for it, I tell you. Uh, well, I'm getting paid, so you're going back to Stellar Bay one way or another. No, that is not going to happen. I spent too many years there smothered by my mama's fears. Now that I'm free, nothing can change my mind. Yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure I would kill him and myself because the whole town would attack me. There's really nothing that can convince you to go home. Stellar Bay is not my home. Not anymore. I finally found the space to breathe. And that's here in Amber Heights. Uh, so what do you want to do about it? Should keep sending people to look for you. Stars, I don't know. My mama's a stubborn woman. She won't quit until I'm dead. You know, that might just work. You go back and tell her you found my body beside the road, all mangled and tore up. If she believes me dead, she won't look for me no more. Uh... Uh, no, I won't do that to Agnes. I'm plain out of ideas then, Captain. I won't go back, and I can't think of a better way to get my mama to stop searching for me. Oh, come on. Can't I? Oh, God damn it. I can't force him. Damn, it's too dumb. Guess I can sell that. I'm not cooking it. It's a vegan playthrough after all. Very vegan. Just like I'm probably gonna turn wine into Peshkitaria. Not a vegan. And I'm gonna still drink milk. Just... <laughs> trying to eat potato, not potato. Chicken breast. And my teeth. I can't. It just doesn't work with my teeth right now. I don't even know what the problem is. Oh, goddamn teeth problem. I had no teeth problems for like five to six years. Because I never went to the dentist. And as soon as I go back to dentists, all I have is teeth pain. Guess I'm staying skinny as hell. Because I can't eat crap anyways. I mean, uh, nah, crap is not on the menu. You are liquor. They opened that already. Puh. Very lunch. Sounds like a kid's commercial. I don't care about these people. I'm gonna kill them. Uh, anyways, in the future, I don't think he would. What an idiot. Didn't even see that. Stealth 100. I think my stealth ain't too bad. Dead eye assault rifle. It's not as good as the pink slip. <laughs> oh, cute. Not even close. Cool. Let's steal from these idiots. Where's Ash? He has cool stories and a cool voice, but way too much to talk yes, about. Before. Mm. I'm new here. Take my advice. Move on. Get off world if you can. If you can't, get to the bay. I've been halfway around T1. <laughs> Monarch, they call it now. Been around it twice. Stood at the hot pole and the cold. Nothing on this moon for nobody. Just a lot of heartbreak. So, what's his story? It's pretty simple, kid. 
I sit at the bar, I drink, I mind my own business. That's it. Oh, you said you've been around the whole moon. You must know a few things. No one else does. The only thing I got to teach is get the fuck off T1. Or whatever they're calling it this week. Anybody with half a brain could tell you that. Look, you want to buy the drinks? I'll do my bit to keep you entertained. Just don't ask me to dance. Oh, heartbreak. What happened to you? A great many things. I'll tell you what. You want to listen to an old man ramble? There might be a job in it for you. I used to run with a squad of mercenaries here. Good folk. A fella named Lamont introduced me. Thing is, I ain't seen them in an age. Stands to reason they got themselves eight. Uh, if they got killed, they must have not. They must not have been terribly talented. What? Better folk than you and me. It don't no. take much of a slip to end up in a sulfur pool or a rap stomach. We split ways around the time this twice fucked moon got abandoned. Thing is, I got myself some fond memories. We had some keepsakes of ours we kept in a lockbox. And I've been thinking about seeing it found. Oh, what if they're still alive, though? I'll be glad for it. But I ain't stupid. This planet tends to get people killed. I just want some closure. You want mementos? What? Photographs or money? Thereabouts. Uh, can't, can't you find them yourself? Getting on in years, kid. Eggs ain't working like they used to. Sulfur burns a little too long in the lungs. This joint's looking like my last home. Hmm. All right, one lockbox coming right up. Appreciate it, kid. I'm marking out posts on your map. You spend a lot of time out there. Might be a good place to start. Here's a key for the door. Yeah, that's a cool voice. And with him, it's pretty easy to detect that he got used multiple times in this game. So his voice pops up with different characters can take that I can take their meat oh for fuck's sake I'm gonna lose my lunch what you're shitting it out or what I can loot in here in the meantime Because I know where that person is that I'm stealing from. No, here. No. Find the Yoka. <laughs> and she opens it back up. Pocket watch. Start. Ah. And saw stuff immediately before I go out again. Oh, a full fridge. Not too bad. Music is gone. Bleh. What the hell? No music for me. Oh, just that. The whole deal bag of tobacco is what? No clue what that's supposed to be. The tobacco is. Look into that. Just quests are kind of stupid. So I don't know if I wanna actually do that. Come in, squad. Come in. Oh shit. <laughs> There's someone right here. Uh, is, is that someone? Hey. Oh, can't talk to her. Oopsie. Um, can't go behind. The house. Oh. Everybody's upstairs. Not important. Not important. A manta queen. Yeah. We felled it, mind. But we lost two runners and five gun hands. A total failure, then. So much for the ruins. 
and hell only knows where the Van Oys are. They never showed. I'm sure they're... Ah, let's talk later. It seems we have company. Talking about me? Nice day, huh? A monarch, anyway. A stranger comes to our home. If you're looking for a path to walk, you've found one. If you're looking for a teacher, I am one. Welcome to the Iconoclasts. <gasps> I feel like a preacher, the vicar, would have had a nice battle with him, a nice mental one. Uh, uh, I'm told you're out of pamphlets. That's a shame. Ah, yes. The first step to accepting the truths of philosophism is to open your heart to its wisdom. I've found the written word to be quite effective in helping people do that. But alas, the eternal truth hasn't been generous with the paper and ink. Mm. Now, why have you come? Uh, I'm looking for experience so I can level up. I'm just looking for ways to help the people here. Anything need doing? A great many things, in fact. We could always use a hand rounding up supplies. Or... Now here's an idea. There's an old printing press I've been trying to get up and running. Uh, why? I have always dreamed of subverting the colony's periodicals and turning the board's own propaganda against them. If I could get my message directly in the hands of Byzantium citizens, I'm sure they'd recognize the truth. Will you aid us in our cause? I think this was easy as hell. Wonderful. I requisitioned replacement rollers for it some time ago. Huxley should have delivered them yesterday. <laughs> Speaking of which, where is Huxley? You bought rollers? You haven't even cleared the wraps out yet. What are you doing wasting bits on... Wait, where is Huxley? It seems we're out a runner. If you intend to help our cause, I'll ask you to meet our MSI supplier in her stead. Yeah, she won't be meeting them. All right, all right. Where's the, supp where's the supplier she then? She meets us in the ruins of Bayside Terrace. From our compound, follow the road north. Or was this an ambush? All right, I'll be back. Wonderful. While you're at it, I wonder if Carlotta still has those high capacity cartridges. Grab a few, will you? There should be some funds left over from the last shipment. We can use them to copy and modify radio serials. Yes, not just magazines, but their precious dramas. Unbelievable. <laughs> I hope I don't have to tell you this, but if there is extra money, would you mind buying, I don't know, food and medicine? Graham, nah. if you need me, I'll be in triage. Nah, I think Graham's idea is way better. For me, to ruin them with. Uh, that's just propaganda. Challenge and the betrayal of his truth. Yep, that's just propaganda. Oh god, I'm, I'm not reading for any of that. The door is open, my car can't close it. So I shouldn't steal stuff, I need sleep and I need to drink. So I'm sleeping right here next to the hill. 76.5 hours. Uh, no, all I'm saying is she gotta be more. Oh, God. Where's Nana Spank? My, my favorite drink. Nana Spank and cocoa milk. Careful throwing away lives like that. Nothing is gonna help you wake up as quickly as Nana Spank. I hear you workers were on the clock every available moment. We always got eight hours a day for sleeping. Just mm. always consecutive. My condolences. I appreciate consistent wages like any other sane person, but that still sounds awful. At least Sanjar gives his folks weekends. Weekends? Hand to the void. I used to drop by the bar in Stellar Bay to knock a few back with the folks who had Saturdays off. Don't know what I'd have done with that much time. I was always behind schedule anyhow. Knowing you, you'd sit and be alone with your thoughts. Weekends. 
Say goodbye to weekends in the future. Well, I'm telling you. I may not work for the hours, so I uh, shouldn't complain. And I'm also gonna be uh, wisdom tooth sick. Fucking god. Do I need you? Nah. Don't need that either. A lot of that stuff. Uh, what are you? Plasma. Changed a lot to plasma lately. Uh, I have a free inventory. Not the best choice. Juxtella Championships, Rissus Rangers vs. Spacers chosen. So weirdly, I've never actually seen a Tossport game in the game. Maybe it's part of the other DLC, the one I haven't played, the detective one. Which I don't think I will play before I finish the story. So dangerous. If, I, if there's a moment in there that's an instant death, it would be too dangerous for me to play that. Where do I want to go? Radiator, search for clues. Pick uh, up Varma. Oh yeah. Mm, talk hard to return home. I failed. I feel like I need interrogation or something pretty high up. Captain McCree, missing passcode. Mm. Oh god. I should go to Fallbrook. Should go to Fallbrook, but I also can turn in one quest here. God damn it! That's too far away. Oh, where this one? Ah, I believe it was not too deadly. I have everything fully upgraded. So I should be capable of surviving a lot of what you can throw at me. Just need to be careful to not fall into a sofa pool. I'll get roasted like a sprout. It's a killed by the campfire. Christ, uh, that did actually just jump scare me. Okay, we're stinkering. Science, right? No? Am I crazy? Tinkering. Oh god, I need that up to a hundred. And I won't get there that quickly. Oh, the hall is just chilling there. Good earrings. The extra money saved with the 90% upgrade is super important afterwards, I guess. I mean, not putting everything into guns is also kind of stupid still. No, 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 just not sleep. I had that already. Oh, good. <laughs> Not at all good. In short. Sealed. That. The moon.
Those are dead. Mysterious circumstances. Okay. Oh god, water. That kind of looks nice. Turn the hot off, take a screenshot. Use it as a thumbnail. Cook. And then the hot on again. God. I could try downloading the hot mod again. Smart hot. There's one Neos here. Hello, sir. Excuse me, but this area is off limits. We got a leaky generator. It ain't safe. Mm hmm. That's my nice way of telling you to saw it off. Uh, what's going on here? Fixing a leaky generator. What's it to you? Uh, I'm supposed to meet someone here. That's what. Right. Carlotta. Yeah, she's inside. We got first rights, though. As soon as we fix that generator, she's ours. Okay. Uh... Look, I don't care what you do here with her. I need her supplies. The point that I need to be impressing upon you and her is that she ain't selling. Okay, cool. Okay, off I go then. Definitely won't snap you. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't do that. Not at all, team. Pavati. Oh, supply. That's salvage. Oopsie. Oopsie. Just Lillian Hager quests, which I don't want to do anyways. Mess with us. Oof. Works. Oh, damn. I'm a fool. Hmm. Don't need that right now. Detection radius of enemies, damage per subsequent hit. Looks good. Uh, I'm kind of confused. This is. Those count as improvised weapons, right? But the pink slip does not, for example, right? That's what I'm getting at improvised weapons. I should look that up for the next time. Um, armor rating bonus. Yes. Ah, yeah, salvage the reputation. Oof. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, that's not that cool. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. But I'm pretty sure I killed everybody. I don't even wanna impress the Amber Heights clowns. I just shot first and fought later. Wait a second, that generator isn't leaking at all. Those bastards lied to me. 
Oh, here you go. Yes, it's easy experience. The most important thing. Making it look easy. It, it was easy. It was easy. Just we're holding a button. Not like Fallout lock picking. Oh, <laughs> that's a nice position to die in. You could scissor right before they died. Mm -hmm. The sublight scissor, the famous one. I heard that. I heard all of that. Who's out there? Whoever you are, you're in a lot of trouble. Hello? Hello? Ah, Jolotta, I stood you. Yeah, and for the hundredth time, I'm not opening this door. Who are you, anyway? Oh, I'm cool, poor Graham sent me to collect supplies. Oh, finally. Tell Graham that this is the last run I'm doing. Sanjar has declared a stop sale to you lot, but even if he hadn't, I'm not risking my neck anymore. Oh, hey, girl. Thanks for clearing out those goons. Please don't kill me next. No promise. Graham ordered rollers and whatsits, right? For a printing press? Here, take them. Like I said, this is my last run. Oh. <laughs> oh. Why did Sandra ban you from working with that? It's pretty obvious. You'd have to ask him. All I know is that if I get caught, I'll get arrested. Oh, why have you been helping? Graham, Money. It's an enviable thing he's doing. Free people and all that. I can't live that way. I need my structure. But I respect the iconoclasts for doing it. Well, will they get the supplies now? Not her problem. Law help them. I don't know. Maybe Sublight can lend a hand. <laughs> yeah, right. I should go. Look, Graham's got a bit or two left in his account. I can send one last dropout before I wash my hands of this. What do you want oh. delivered? <laughs> Pamphlets. Uh, high capacity data cartridges. Yeah, I've got a few. I'll send them along. Free Give XP. them all my regards. And good luck out there. Don't go getting eaten. Yep, you too. Oh, I can just take it. It's mine now. Nice shop, by the way. Wait, was that a better mask? No. Damn, there's a lot of supplies here. Good thing she ain't attacking me. I mean, she wouldn't survive it anyways. Nothing she can do, realistically. Besides, just work with what I do. Oh, nice save. Mine. Damn, a lot of good loot in here. Sure, sure. That didn't scare me at all. <laughs> that didn't jump scare me. 36, 22. It's definitely not the best choice. Okay, okay. I can fast travel, right? Or do I have that disabled? No, it's just impossible to. Yes, yes. That sound, that sound is just going my ears. Oh, oh <laughs> blueprints. Okay, there's two people I need to talk to here. First, Mama. Any news, Captain? Have you found my little boy yet? Yes. Yes, your little boy is a grown man. What's that got to do with anything? He's always going to be my little boy. And I'm always going to be his loving mama. I know what's best for him. And that's living here in Stellar Bay. Hmm. Maybe you should let him be. He seems happy in Amber Heights. No, he's just putting on a brave face. My little ducky needs his mama to care for him. You told me you'd bring him back, so go do it. Uh, fine. I'm relying on your goodwill, stranger. Don't do me wrong. 
<laughs> I'm not doing this out of before you met the captain, I mean. Nah, I mostly just drank and hunted. Soon as you stop to dream of other things, that'll be the day something sneaks up and eats you. Don't fret, I'm watching your back now. Anything tries to eat us, I'll give it a mighty whack on the nose. Well, I'll be damned. You watch my back, I'll watch yours. Instant friendship. Oh, Velma. Velma is somebody else I need to talk to. Let's see first if they have something new. Huh? Staying oh. long? Thank you again for ret Anyway? Nope. Nope. Where's Velma? Here. I didn't steal that poster. I hear those rich people in Byzantium pay a handsome bit for rap money. Hey, Velma, I got your caffeinoid pills. You're a lifesaver. Hope Abigail didn't give you a hard time. Just the usual. Any word on Braxton? Nothing. Don't know how much longer I can cover for him either. Give me those pills, will you? Here you go. You know, you might consider a real night's sleep instead. Who the hell are you? Velma's not so bad, as long as you avoid her when she's stressed. I'd give you a friendlier welcome, but... ...and salt tuna guts. Gosh, this old girl's in a rough way. Even old Bess in Edgewater was in better shape than this. Hey, you want to try running a cannery with obsolete machinery? You be my guest. Um, sorry ma'am, I wasn't trying to be rude, it's just... ...your flanging apparatus isn't making a strong flange, so your sealer isn't sealing right, and... Oh. I see what you're saying. Huh. I'll have to try that. Anyway, what do you folks need? Oh, I've got some bad news about Braxton. That he's got his load on and I'm stuck covering his shift? Oh, he was killed by cannibals out in the ruins. That's... Wow. I sure feel like an ass now. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a rotten way to go. Yeah, I wouldn't wish that on Catherine herself. Still, it's good to know what happened to him. And that I ought to start looking for a replacement. Something else on your mind? No. Thanks for your money and experience. Oh, okay, I'm done here. Back to Amber Heights. Journal map. Region. Yeah. Damn, I haven't discovered that much here. I'm done. The episode is over. And Fulbrook will be next. What do you think of the unreliable Parvati? There's always something to fix. And it's neat working in the Aether. I always took Atmo for granted. Now, if I drill through the hole, we all suffocate. Exciting, you know? I, I'm not sure I wanted to know that. Being in space sets me on edge enough. You know about stellar emissions? A actually, I probably shouldn't tell you about those. I mean, not unless you want to know how we're all likely to get spacers long. Right. Okay. When we get back to the ship, I'm drinking this conversation right out of my recollection. Nah, no drinking on my ship. It's not allowed. Here. That's where I need to go. Only water. No sugar in it. You. I'm telling you, the Van Noys are fine. Bullshit, Graham. They don't just abandon orders, and they weren't at the ruins. Where in this sulfur-sodden hellhole did you send them? They're on a very important... Ah, we'll continue this later. Welcome back, Captain. I got your orders, and she had those cartridges after all. Damn it. <laughs> I was hoping you'd have more sense than our venerable leader here. I get the message is important, but so's eating. Bah. Carlotta usually schedules the next drop during the meeting. When's she coming? If I can't eat, nobody can. She isn't Sanja has declared a stop sale on goods to the iconoclasts. That is most unfortunate. This cuts off one of our only two supply lines on Monarch. Sanja, our old friend, you're about to cross a dangerous line. Meh. About to? That idiot just declared war. I... We will deal with his subversion later. For now, we must redouble our efforts to spread the truth to the colony. Mm, mm, mm. 
Oh, time to fix the printing press done, huh? The print... Oh, no. Graham, you didn't. I've already sent a team ahead to scout the press. One of our best. Meet them there and find out if they've been successful. You sent the Vanoys there, didn't you? Oh, for fuck's sake, Graham! We needed them in the ruins! Our people died out there! They went willing to fight for our cause. We need reinforcements. We need new recruits. The Van Noys saw the printing facility with the same importance as I. The hell's the sense in recruiting if you're just gonna get them killed? I have the utmost confidence in their abilities. Friends, we must have faith that the men and women we recruit can handle the duties for which we recruit them. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> uh... Do you two ever stop bickering? This is worth bickering over. The iconoclasts can't keep their heads in the ground forever, or they're going to starve and die slow. Look, just... If the Vernois are still alive, get them out of there. With Sanjar pressing the issue like this, I have a feeling we'll need them. Sora, trust me, you won't die slowly. I will make it quick. The printing press comes first. <laughs> oh, it's the most important thing. First, so we can look if we can tell Taka to go home to his mama. His mama needs him. He's not safe out here. Or I could just leave him here and then kill him with the rest when I'm done. Well met, Captain. What do you need? Go back to your mama. I don't much want to talk about it. Ah. Uh, no. Let's see. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. He wins. He will die here with the other boys. Oh, he's not safe out there, his mama said. <laughs> She's right. I'm the danger. Hard in Stellar Bay? I had a fling or two, sure. But on Monarch, relationships ain't usually meant to last. A lot of fools tried to impress me, feigning bravado in the wilds, thinking they'd catch my attention with their stories. It was cute. Not so cute when their act got themselves munched. You know what's sexy? Confidence. You know what ain't? Disembowelment. What, you're not into people with just the hair, one leg because they're stuck in a, looks like headstone. It's not coral. Yo, Amber Heights, some also Amber Lows. They're gonna die for low blows. I'm gonna make them look like worthless hoes. I'm gonna shoot off their toes. Won't accept no nose. Mm, peace out, bros. Sure. Yo.